Africa is home to some of the most amazing predators on Earth. Whether big or small, cats are efficient and deadly hunters. In Africa, two of the top feline predators are the caracalla and the servile. The easiest way to identify between a caracalla and a servile is their color. Although they are similar cats in many ways, they don't look similar to one another at all. Caracals are tan or golden brown cats with no patterns across their bodies. Their ears are black and white, and they have some black coloration across their mouths, but aside from that, they are solid colored. Servals are beautiful cats characterized by their light golden body and black spotted pattern. They have a white underbelly and inner legs. Caracals, sometimes called desert lynx or Persian lynx, are not actually members of the lynx family though many people confuse them with lynx because of their ear tufts. These small, slender cats are notable for their spotted coats, big ears, and long legs. They are sometimes called giraffe cats due to their long legs and spots. Another visible differentiator between the two is the presence of ear tufts. Caracals have distinct ear tufts that are normally black and white. These ear tufts extend a few inches past the ear and are visible from all sides of the cat. The servile doesn't have any distinct ear tufts as the caracal does. One other feature, however, is simply how large their ears are in relation to their head. The ears of the servile are rather large and can be moved around in order to listen for prey. An adult caracal can weigh from 20 to 40 pounds. To give you a better idea, a 30-pound caracal weighs as much as two bowling balls. A caracal is about 24 to 42 inches long and 18 inches tall from its shoulder. The servile is a very slender cat. Adults can reach 24 inches in shoulder height. 39 inches in length and weigh up to 20 to 44 pounds. The caracal is primarily a nocturnal animal, meaning that it is most active when the sun has set. Still, there are some examples where caracals have come out during the day as they can be active when the need arises. Some studies show that they are generally more active when the temperatures decrease below 68 degrees Fahrenheit. The servile is more varied in the hours that it is active. Most servals are active during the day and the night, depending on the day. Generally, servile activity peaks in mid-morning and at dusk and midnight. When the weather is cooler, servals are more likely to be active. During the hottest parts of the day, servals will rest in the shade, as many other predators do. Caracals are strictly carnivorous. They prey primarily on birds, rodents and small antelopes. Like most cats, Caracals stalk their prey before pouncing on it. Servals eat a great variety of prey, including rodents, birds, reptiles, frogs, and insects. They catch much of their prey by leaping high into the air and pouncing. Caracals inhabit forests, woodlands, savannas, grasslands, semi-deserts, and scrub forests, but prefer dry areas with low rainfall and availability of cover. Servals live near thickly planted streams and rivers in the savannas of Central and Southern Africa. Unlike many other cats, these small felines love to climb, leap, and play in the water. Like the rest of the small cats, caracals may purr when content and make a variety of other mews, growls, and hisses to express their mood. Caracals are usually silent, but can cry out like a leopard, if needed. Servals have highly developed hearing to help them detect prey, and they communicate using a variety of sounds, including purrs, a high-pitched meow, a nasal mwa repeated multiple times, and a low, purring growl. Caracals can breed any time during the year, but pregnant females are most common during winter and spring. After a pregnancy of 70 to 80 days, females give birth to one to four kittens. Litters are born all year round but mostly in summer. The servile reaches sexual maturity at the age of 18 months. They do not have a specific mating season. The females have a gestation period of about 74 days. The servile can have up to five servile cubs. The normal is two to three cubs. Kittens are weaned from their mother around 10 weeks and begin to eat meat at this time. Caracal kittens remain with their mothers up to a year before leaving to find their own territory. Servile kittens become independent at 6 to 8 months but will often remain near the mother for at least a year. 
caracals are found in most regions of Africa and from the Arabian Peninsula through northwest India. Servals live near thickly planted streams and rivers in the savannas of Central and Southern Africa. The average lifespan for a caracal in the wild is 10 to 12 years. In captivity, they can live 15 to 18 years. Servals generally live 10 to 12 years in the wild and can live up to 20 years or more in captivity.